It is very nice to greet you again. In today's video we will talk about the following. Legitimate reasons why you should get back with your ex. Having a legitimate reason to get back with your partner is very important. In fact, I'm telling you that if you don't have a legitimate reason to get back together, I can't help you. Why? Because without a truly legitimate reason you're setting yourself up for failure. I'm going to show you examples of bad and good reasons to get back together with your ex. 1. Caution above all. I'm very adamant about implementing a no-contact rule before taking any steps to get back together with your ex. However, since we're focusing today on the reasons you have to get back together with your ex, I'm not going to recommend the no-contact rule. Why? Because anything you talk about from this point on should be done before the no-contact period. Think of this as a pre-test. Okay. Before I can start listing the reasons, you need to define, legitimate. Having a good reason to get back together isn't always easy to define. Every situation is different and will be unique. However, there are certain guidelines you can refer to in order to determine if you are on the right track. Guideline 1. Any reason stemming from desperation or loneliness is not a good reason. Guideline 2. A truly legitimate reason to get back together will have substance and can be explained in depth. Let's look at some examples of really bad reasons for wanting to get back together with your ex. I will die without him or her. My whole life revolved around him or her. I will never find anyone as good as him or her again. It will be different next time. Note how each of these reasons are not actually reasons at all. Well, I guess they are, technically, but not the kind you were looking for. They are certainly not the kind that are required to have a successful relationship the second time around. Let's break down why these reasons are really bad. I will die without him or her. Will you really? I didn't realize that someone who broke up with you could physically kill you. I mean, I guess a couple that has been together for a long time and suddenly someone passes away can kill someone out of heartbreak, but come on, that's a really rare case. My whole life revolved around him or her. I can guarantee you that your whole existence does not revolve around your ex. This is desperation at its finest. The, I don't know how I can live without him or her, excuse. The fact of the matter is that you can have a very happy life without it revolving around someone else. I will never find anyone as good as him or her again. I really don't like this reason. First of all, how do you know that you will never find someone as good again? Secondly, you are basically admitting here that your ex is the best thing you will ever have. What if he or she was a horrible partner? By using this reason, you are settling for the easy way out. It will be different next time. You can become the perfect partner, the perfect husband or wife, but you have to remember that relationships are a two-way street. There are two of you and you can't be the only person trying hard enough. 2. Good reasons to get back together. The breakup was a rash decision. You were happy almost the entire time you were together. You both want the same things from a life together. I would say that these reasons listed are great reasons to get back together. Some of you may think certain points are controversial, but don't worry. I'm going to go through each reason and explain why I consider these good legitimate reasons to get back with your ex. The breakup was a rash decision. Sometimes couples break up for impulsive reasons. This is a good reason to get back together if the impulsive decision to break up stemmed from a specific problem that doesn't encompass the entire relationship. You may have even tried to fix this problem but were unsuccessful. In this case it may be worth trying the relationship again. You were happy almost the entire time you were together. I don't expect you to have had a perfect relationship. Every real couple has had a fight. It's no secret that fights really suck. Let's imagine for a moment that a couple who got along great throughout their relationship had a huge fight and broke up. They were both very happy in their relationship, but they had a huge fight that temporarily changed the status of their relationship. It's important to remember that no relationship is perfect. Everyone has their ups and downs and if you or your ex ruined your relationship because of a bad experience, then you have a legitimate claim to wanting to get back together. You both want the same things out of a life together. If you want the same things in life together, then that's a really good thing. Don't let their bad qualities overshadow this. Maybe they're worth getting back together with. You are an essential part of what we do on this channel. For this reason, we keep an eye on what you need, and if it is your desire to recover your ex correctly and effectively, you must click on the link below.